All right, happy Friday, everybody. Today we're gonna be doing, I think it's the second last episode. I, I'm pretty sure, cause then after this, it's the castle. So, because I've now locked myself into that, this will probably be kind of a long episode because this is the longest dungeon. This is the longest path to the dungeon. Um, I've also upgraded all my stuff off camera so you don't have to see all that boring stuff because now we can split into three links. And I've got a couple new items that we can show you real quick. Hold on. I, yeah, sorry I've, I've been gone for the past couple days. I wanted to get this finished right away, but like I've been having the craziest time. Like I've had the craziest day today and I'll tell you all about it once I get past this area because this entire section is really gonna test my memory. I, for some reason, can't quite remember all of this stuff. Oh, I remember these guys. Get out of here. And so I've got bombs, I've got arrows, these are the remote bombs, you just put them there and then you just press A and it'll go. And that's my phone, let me just put that on mute, hold on. Wait a minute, is it 10 o'clock? How is it 10 o'clock? It's not 10 o'clock. No way. I was, it was, I looked at the clock like five minutes ago and it was seven. What happened? Oh my god. Alright, so we've got another fairy. I think this is the fairy who asks you a bunch of questions and if you get one wrong, she's like, get the hell out of here. She hates you. Um, yeah, okay. So let's tell her all about our adventures. Oh, I need to focus on this, because, uh... <laughs> uh, fire element. No, it was that other one. <laughs> See? I remember things. <laughs> Grandfather's name is Smee, is it? it? Isn't it? No, it's Smith! Um, no? Yes, yes, I see. Malari of Mount Crenel has seven apprentices. I'm pretty sure he does. Um... Because I know at least one of these answers is a yes, and it has to- <laughs> I'm pretty sure it's this one. Okay, so we're good. Um, the blabber nut gives one the ability to understand the minish, does it not? No, it doesn't because it's the jabber nut. Bam, I remember. Uh, yes, I see. Now for the next question. The robe of the current king of Hyrule Daltus is white, is it not? No, it's red. The white one is the dead guy who was talking to us. Right? But anyway, this whole thing is pointless because it gives us the large quiver, which lets you hold 99 arrows. You will never need 99 arrows. It's such overkill, and I absolutely love it. I wish every single Zelda game would just give you way too many things. Alright, so let's get out of here. I don't like these woods. They're spooky scary. This is the wrong way. <laughs> okay, spooky scary. Um, oh yeah, I remember this. It's like, whoever, whatever team that did this whole Zelda, they sure love- Okay, so all the signs, you have to follow the signs. They, they must love Ocarina of Time. There's so many references. So many, so many- Okay, uh, left. Like, we're going to, to, to Dampe's house right now, the Gravedigger. I mean, I, yeah, he's in a bunch of games, but there's so many just specific Ocarina of Time things before, or in here. Um, uh, 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 I, I believe I pointed them out. I can't remember things from three days ago. Um, and I think you go right. Yeah. And then you go up. Pretty sure you go up. Pretty sure. Yeah. Hey, 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 hey. Woo! Good thing we have our little lantern. Okay, we've gotta find Dampe's house. Pretty sure he lives up. Oh, okay. Up? Nope, okay. Uh, oh, yeah. Alright. What's up, man? Yes, I was here. The king called me. Dead king called me. Anyway, nice. We got it. Just kidding. We don't. Bird stole it. And then another, and another bird stole it, actually. Yeah. Poor Link. Poor Link. Everyone's so mean to baby Link. Nabe, help me! No. Okay, so we gotta, we gotta, we gotta, you gotta just find a corner of him and then run into the tree. But if you, oh, there he is. Okay, so we gotta back up a little. Need a running start. Yeah. Did I get it? Nice. All right. Oh, Link. To put it on a lanyard. Having a terrible day. Oh, speaking of terrible days. Okay, my day wasn't terrible per se, but it was wild. Like, I woke up this morning. I was already late. <laughs> I don't know why this keeps happening to me. I can't I can't sleep and then I just oversleep and then I'm trapped at home and oh, it's bad. Um, but yeah, I was late. 
um, because I tried to cross the street and found that my entire road was flooded because like they've been working on construction on my street for like months now and I guess they screwed it up even though they've been taking their time on it because like um, I think a, a pipe burst and because it split the road open and water was gushing out of it so the whole road was just a river and it was such a weird color too it was like a bluey green all right um, is it this one? Yes, it is this one. Okay, we gotta... Nope, it's not that one. Never mind. <laughs> There's a lot of this going on in this section, I think. Then what happened? Um, some poor guy was passed out completely. Okay, that does nothing. Oh, wait, I remember. Um, passed out at the train station, so I had... I hope he's okay, my god. It was like the paramedics were there and they were like slapping him around like hey buddy stay with me stay with me but he was not staying with them so I hope he's okay oh my gosh I was already late for work um then what happened and I got to work and oh um those of you who already know where I work that's fine but um I I work at a a, a location I cannot disclose on the internet um, for a company I cannot disclose, but I'm sure a lot of you like this company. You're watching my channel. Um, I will not speak any further on that topic because I do not represent the company that I work for. Um, but yeah, what I do is I basically authorize returns for our product. And I think this one's fake. Uh, I think it's this one in the center? Yes, because okay, look, these ones are fake. Oh! <laughs> um, but what happened is every single store screwed it up, so I got nothing done out for the first, like, hour. Because, like, I all I do is authorize returns for, for the first part of my morning, and every single store couldn't get it right. Oh, jeez. That guy came a lot faster than I expected. Hey, watch out! Oh, that didn't get done. My morning was a bust. And then my boss told me to pack up- okay. I can't really talk about anything to do with work because everyone will figure it out. Um, but my boss told me to pack up a bunch of demo stations for various products that we have. And no, I really can't talk about because you'll figure it out. Um, but I- these, these demo stations have been sitting in the back of the where- oh, what happened? At the back of the warehouse for years and years and years and not, not once had it occurred to me that they are in perfect working condition <laughs> so I finally plugged them in today and they totally work perfectly Oh damn it! Too slow Too distracted talking about my day So I just played with them for like all afternoon like me and my friends were playing Okay, it's a, it was an N64 demo station that I was packing up and it had um, Smash Bros in it and we just played um, Smash uh, for the rest of the morning. And that link's floating. Uh, <laughs> it was awesome. I love Fat Pikachu. Die, 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 die. Um, in Smash for Smash for the 64. Because he's so round and his costumes are Party Hat. I love Party Hat Pikachu. Forever Party Hat Pikachu main. Only party hat Pikachu. Ah! I'm actually a Lucina main. Ah! I gotta get behind these guys. Like, sure you can- Oh my god, how do <laughs> I'm not focusing. Um, you can kill them without setting them on fire, but they have a lot of health and it just takes forever, while, whereas Stalfo's just one, two hit. One, two, and they die. Um, it's probably the, the wrong route to take since I'm just sort of jabbering on. Let me just look for some hearts. Not that it matters because we're done this section now. Woo! We also had a NES, or no, a Super NES. Oh, his robe isn't white, I thought it was white. I guess his whole self is just white. Uh, demo station, but it the screen was busted. It had a Killer Instinct in it and I was trying to play it, but I couldn't see anything. It was horrible. And like I was like waiting for the TV to warm up and nope, it was just like that. The TV, the, this super old CRT, it's like all fuzzy. That demo station is older than I am. 
It's from 1991. And look at this, the king will warp us out, so convenient. So considerate. Um, what are the demo stations that we have? Uh, if you follow my Instagram right now, you can see me inside one of the demo stations because um, it was unlocked and I could just get in there. If not, don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. It's the wrong way, isn't it? Which way is it? Is it this one? Yeah! Yeah! Okay, no, 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 we're good. Um... There was a GameCube station which I got working. Just have to plug in everything, this is not it. <laughs> Come on, Link, where are we going? One of these. Somewhere. Maybe I'm on the wrong side. Okay, source of the flow. That means this waterfall. So we want to get- oh, up at the top there! Okay, so we're in the wrong section. Yeah, there was a GameCube demo station which I got working because I had to plug everything in weird. Um, but weirdly, it didn't have any Nintendo games on it. It was like, the demo discs only had like, Beautiful Joe, 1080 Snowboarding Avalanche... What was it? I'll post a video. No, I'm not allowed to post a video. Um, what else was there? There were no Nintendo games. Oh, there was F-Zero, I guess. That was the only sort of Nintendo game um, on that whole weird demo disc. Uh, get out of here. This way. This way. And there was a Wii and a Wii U demo station as well, but those were disgusting. I did not want to touch them. It was like my coworker. Oh gosh, we're rumbling. Uh, opened opened up the 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 Wiimote, and a bunch of black goop fell out of the sleeve, the Wiimote sleeve. It was disgusting. It was horrible. All right. Pew. Oh, now we go through here. Ah. What else happened today? I cleared out an area because we're gonna be getting a kitchen, so that's exciting. I've been working in a warehouse without a kitchen. No food for us. What's in here? Oh! I have 999 shells, I think, so this doesn't mean anything to me. I'm gonna go in the wrong way. Nope, I'm not. Oh, the other way was the right way. Uh, let me just... Uh, let me check for treasure. I think this is the right way. I just wanna check for treasure. Ugh, ugh, give me too many paths. What's out this way? Treasure? No, I think this is the way up. Okay, okay, we're going back for treasure. Woo! Oh, so I had to... So what I was doing with, with the, the demo stations, my boss wanted me to wrap them up and send them to our headquarters, which I cannot disclose to the public. I don't know why my boss asked me to do it, because first of all, I'm 5'4", and I put all these demo stations on pallets, which was difficult enough, and when they're on pallets, they suddenly become about mm, six and a half feet tall or so. So I was trying to wrap them, um, <laughs> one, nope, one, nope. This way? This way. This way. This way. Nope. This way. I had to wrap them in plastic wrap so I could ship them over the border. I guess he just trusts me the most, which... Yeah! Hell yeah. My boss trusts me. My old co-worker co used to call me his best man because I did everything. And then he left. Um, but yeah, my, my boss asked me to wrap these IA stations, um, these these demo stations with plastic wrap, and because I'm only 5'4", I am not 5 feet tall like um, some people would lead you to believe, Amy, um... Ah, oh, we can just ignore that guy. Whoops, what'd I do? Ah, wah! Um, because I'm only 5'4", I was only able to wrap the bottom half of the stations, so like... 
You know how when kids decorate a Christmas tree and only the bottom half is done? Let me just get out of here. That's what the stations looked like when I was wrapping them plastic wrap. Only the bottom was done. And the top I just covered in like foam. And I was still too short. So, yeah. Nice. And I was getting so mad at this point because like the plastic wrap, it's on this horrible like holding thingy. Um, it's supposed to help you, but it really doesn't help you. It weighs like 30 pounds for no reason. So I was using it uh, incorrectly because I hate it so much. And the whole thing swung back, hit me in the mouth. So I was bleeding during this entire thing. Um, but what I did to wrap the top half of the demo stations was I stood on a rolling ladder and I got my coworker to roll me around the, the pallets while I was holding the, the plastic wrap, which it was actually one of the safer options because what I initially um, suggested was I stand on a ladder, that, like, a, like a, a step stool that was mounted onto a rolling dolly, <laughs> which would have been fine, I think, because I... Actually, no, I could have died. Um, so I, I, I was on the, the official, the real rolling ladder. I'll come back for all the goods later. Oops. Nope, let me just blow that up. So I was getting pushed around while holding a thing, bleeding out of my mouth. <laughs> um, plastic wrapping a Wii station because, yeah, I didn't want to- I didn't plug in the Wii station because it was disgusting. I didn't want to play it. And the Wii U. I think I did a pretty good job. I really hope that our headquarters will be happy with my work. I'm quite happy with my work. Oh, it put us back down here. Wait, what's downstairs? We already went. No, we didn't go downstairs. Cool. Okay, these are all fake, so I'm just gonna run past them. I think one of them's real, but I don't really care. I don't need rupees. Ooh, what's this way? Nope, we still have to do something. Ooh, 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 ooh. I gotta come back. I gotta fuse some pinstone pieces. But yeah, I. Oh, wait a minute. There's something in here, isn't there? Nope. In here? Yep. Cool. I thought it was like something cool. Whatever. It's fine. And then what happened? After I... I've had such a day. Uh, <laughs> then my friend came over. My dear sweet friend. She brought us some Valentine's treats. Like, uh, she got me those nano blocks? Or I think they're called? Like, you know, the... Pokemon ones that they do. They have Kirby ones now, and they are so cute. They're so cute. Oh, hear that? Goron time. No, we haven't hit a dead end. Check this shit out. Woo! And we have finally made it onto the third, well, fourth area where the next dungeon will be. Um, where was I? What was I talking about? A lot of kinstone fusion in this one. So we gotta get this guy all cleared out. What's up, man? Yeah, 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 yeah. But yeah, I got a little, I got a little Kirby. Uh, well, I didn't get Kirby. I got Krakow, the cloud guy who zaps ya. And rains on ya. Boss. And it's so cute. I love it so much. But like, why did, why didn't Lego, like, why does, why does Nano Blocks have, 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 have all the little, the cute little nothing, uh, sets, you know? Cause like, they have all the little Pokemon ones, they have all of the Kirby ones, but Lego, like official Lego, they only have the giant expensive sets, what's up with that? It's like the the oh they have the NES one which I have not posted the second video of maybe I should do that maybe not I don't know and giant Bowser and the Mario block one but there's no like little garbage sets you know I like the little garbage sets like, LEGO does so many little garbage sets, like, for, for Star Wars and stuff. But no little garbage sets for, for, for Nintendo? 
What's up with that? And I'm talking about like those those sets that have like two characters and they're depicting like one whole scene from like a movie or TV show or game or something. Okay, this is gonna be a lot of this. Uh, nope. We gotta go find these stones. They're around here somewhere. Uh... Don't fall! But like, yeah, I just want a little tiny baby set, like... For Zelda! Or... Well, I wish Pokemon was with a good type of block, like... I'm sorry, nano blocks, but Lego is just so much better. <laughs> the quality of the bricks is better. Okay, whoa, oh, uh, is it you? Nope, nothing there. Okay, how do I get out of here? How do I get out of here? Oh, I have to kill these guys, don't I? Come on, come on out. Oh. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. It's like, just link in the clouds, that'd be a fun scene. Like, sure, you can jump- wait, 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 you can just try to get these guys to fall off the edge and they'll go. Yes. Did it. Like, what are- what's another cute little scene? Like, I- I really appreciate that LEGO's got all these really big, giant, expensive sets for Nintendo, but what about just... a random, like, Earthbound scene, or like, a random... actual nice Kirby scene. Get some Pokemans in there. Get some- okay, is it this one? Alright. Because, like, they- uh... It's just upsetting where all these other cool... IPs have all these nothing set- How do we- uh... Is it- do I have to switch back at him? Like, Star Wars! Nope, it's not that one. Star Wars has the most garbage sets- well, not garbage, but the most cheap little sets. How do I, how do I, is it, is it this? What does this guy do? I can't remember, I can't remember. Nope, it's not, okay. Can I just shoot him? If I just shoot him. You. Hey, You. Is it doing anything? I think it's doing something. Ugh. Ugh. Stop. So annoying. I need the light arrows. Ah, damn it! Yes! No! Just kidding! Woo! Um, where was I? <laughs> um, um, um... Oh! Like, there's the Star Wars set that I wanted. Um, from, from, from episode 3. Um, you know the one, you know the one where he's, uh, where Anakin's standing on the, on the lava, um... What's that scene? Uh, don't make me kill you. Anakin, my allegiance is to the Republic, to democracy. If you're not with me, then you're my enemy. You know, that scene, that's the scene. They had an entire Lego set just for that scene. Um, just with Anakin standing on the, on the, on the, um, by the lava. And it was $15. And it's like, why, why can't Lego do something like that for Nintendo? Ooh, uh, oh no, don't fall in. Like. Name some iconic scenes that Nintendo could do. I bet there's a million. A million billion. And Nintendo's bigger than, well, Pokemon is like the biggest media franchise ever, right? So like, the anime could have some, the games could have some. Oh, can you imagine like a whole set with like all the Elite Four as just um, little Lego guys? Mini figure, mini figs, ugh. And then all just their little Pokemon. Like, nothing else. That's all I want. I don't want anything. I just want a collection of minifigs for, for Pokemon. Because, like, it's not like any other company does that. Any other brick, Lego, plastic company does that. Uh, I should have bought that stupid Star Wars set. But I was like, what am I gonna use this for? It's literally the only scene that I know lines from. <laughs> I don't know why! It's just such a funny scene! Um... You know? You're not with me, you're my enemy! Only a Sith deals in absolutes. Oh... Yes! Got one! Do what I must! You will try! 
And then they fight! <laughs> so stupid. Alright, there's one of five. That's all I can think about right now. I should rewatch Revenge of the Sith. Um, I haven't even seen the last Star Wars movie. Because everyone said it was bad, so I was like, I don't want to expose myself to a shitty Star Wars movie. Not again! <laughs> uh, I think it's this way? Man, this place is a maze. It's it's funny, like, the, the, the forest was a traditional maze, you know? Walls and whatnot. And then this one, it's a completely open area, and yet I feel trapped. I feel completely trapped, even though we're up in the sky. Okay, was it you now? Is it you that I have this one for? Yeah, nice. Hold on, I need a drink of water. What are we at? 25 minutes, oof. Oh, I never even finished talking about my day because I went on my Lego Nanoblocks rant. <laughs> Man, I did- ugh. Nanoblocks, come on! Because they, they're, they're bricks. Yeah, sure, they're tiny, but it's a novelty. It's not like they're better qual- I have to get around. I have to go around this. Oh, I was already here. Oh, no. Oh, no! Um... Alright. Go back the other way. <laughs> At least, like, if you're trapped in a traditional maze, like, there's always gonna be an exit, so if you wanna get out of a traditional maze, you just pick a side- like, follow along the right wall the entire time, and eventually, you'll get out, no matter what. Um, or is it the left wall? It doesn't matter. Either way, there's walls. But this one, no walls. Lost forever. Where am I going? I don't know. Ah. Ugh. The only way to get these guys to jump is to bait them, but then they run past you. Nice. Hey, we're getting somewhere. Not to the dungeon yet, but <laughs> we're getting somewhere. Hmm. Should, uh, should I cut this episode? I wanted this to be the second last. Ah. Oh. Then I'll have to cut the next episode right in the middle as well. Cause like, this game is perfectly separated into nice big blocks. Right? It's like, every section before the dungeon. Perfect time to explore. A little area before the dungeon to get you used to the theme of the whole thing. And then you have the actual dungeon, which is short and sweet, and you got the nice little boss. And you move on. I love this game for that. Let's go down. Let's try going down. Yeah. Well, if you split it up, it throws off the whole... Like, the whole pacing of, of the thing, I feel like. It's just perfectly split up for playing. But for making a video? A little harder. Zelda 1 perfectly split into equal, well, except for the last dungeon, I guess. Because all the dungeons are super short except for that last one. Um, it's all split into little, small little parts, so I was able to do that in like, what was that, 10 minute bursts? That original set of videos. And then every other Zelda, all the dungeons are really, really long, and most of the game. And then there's Breath of the Wild. Which, I mean, you can- I'd love that because, yeah, you can split it anywhere, it doesn't uh, interrupt the flow of the game. But, then again, is there really a flow of the game? There's no sections, there's different areas. I'm so lost right now, I'm just wandering, because I can't remember where I'm going. Oof. This is the worst part for me. One more, where is it? Is it you? Ugh. God. Is it here? Was I already here? I can't remember. Ugh, enemies. So I guess not. Die. Die. I hate you. Piranha. How are you swimming in clouds? That doesn't even make sense. Oh, it's right there. It's right there. Just want to make sure it doesn't drop anything. 
Ah! Oh! <laughs> come on, come on, come on, just hit me. Okay, nothing happened. I never even finished talking about what I've done all day. Um, right, so... My lovely co-worker helped her get some stuff. Went home super late. This is not it. This is not it. Oh my god. I'm back at the beginning. What have I done? Do you have anything for me? No. Man, come on. I'll be back, man. Damn. <laughs> I am so sorry. I'll stop talking and focus, maybe. Maybe. Okay, so the path is linear up until... Where? I didn't fall down the first time. I went past this. So we'll fall down here first. Yeah, there we go. See, I knew I... Oh, what a goon. And I just have to find that last piece. Oh, but yeah, I went home. Uh, and then I made cupcakes. And suddenly now it's 10 o'clock. <laughs> I... So, the way I make cupcakes... Uh, I don't have any baking materials. I don't even have a stand mixer. So I got cake, mi cake mix like a while ago. Okay, so we could go down here, but we're gonna go up first. Remember, remember, remember. No, I was already here. Okay, let's go down for a little bit. Just a little bit, just to check. Just to make sure. Just to make sure it's clear. Yeah, okay. Um, so I had to whisk the cake batter. And I don't like using my oven because it's really, really old and I can't tell if it's on or off because there's, the, there's no lights. Um, so we're gonna go down first. Or is that bad? No, not down. We already went down, didn't we? We already did, we already did. No, what we can do, we can f Aww, I goofed it. I goofed it. I was trying to get back so we could fall and then it would put us back at that place. Okay, so don't go down. So, I... Okay, back to cupcakes. I don't have any cupcake material. I stole a bunch of sprinkles from my mother. That's it. So, and I only have one pan. So I was... And I don't have... And I was using my air fryer. <laughs> this is getting worse. This is getting worse and worse. Um, so I was filling uh, my one pan, uh, dumping all the cupcakes out, Filling it back up again as fast as I could. Yeah, okay. And I did that four times in my little air fryer, and the cupcake pan barely fit into the air fryer, but it is possible. If you want to air fry cupcakes, you can totally do it. Because again, an air fryer is just an oven. I don't like that they call it an air fryer. It's just a normal ass oven. It's a convection oven. Everyone's got a convection oven. But they're marketing it as an as a, as a, as a air fryer, but big toaster oven. Um, but it's just a convection oven. And you can make anything in it. I highly recommend getting a toaster oven style um, air fryer. Big quotation marks. Because you really can't cook anything in it. Like where the basket style air fryers are, sure they're great at cooking like fries and whatever, but they're really really tiny and they suck. And sure it's faster, but the cost of having a tiny little thing, a tiny little basket. You'll have to cook it. Like, if you want a whole bunch of fries, you're gonna have to put, like, multiple different sets of fries in there. But toaster oven, it's the best. It is the best. You can cook anything in it, I swear. Okay, so how, how do we get back to the beginning now? Um... I remember there being a secret somewhere. I just haven't... I'm not seeing it. Where is it? Is it up here? No. Take me back to the beginning, please. This ain't it. Oh my god. Uh, it's down, right? Uh oh. We can make it, we can make it, we can make it, we can make it. Yeah! Convection oven, you can make toast in it. Can't do that in an air fryer. You can make chicken wings. You can bake a cake in it. You can make your normal fries. You can do all your chickens. You can... I made a steak in the air fryer once. Wasn't super great, but man, it was really fast. Right, wreck. Number one fan of, of air fryer ovens right here. Um, yeah. <laughs> all right, 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 all right. 
Last one. Woo! Finally made it to the dungeon. Half an hour in. <laughs> this is a long dungeon, too. Bye! How come these guys get to fly? Why do I need Ezlo? Woo! I love Link's messy hair when he takes his hat off. It's so cute! Another warp point? I'm hoping that most of you have finished this game by now. But I'm not really gonna talk about the dungeon itself. Um... Oh, there's that warp kinstone that we had earlier. I just want to do kinstones. I love kinstones. Two things that- three things I like. Lego, brand Legos, kinstones, air fryers. <laughs> but don't- don't get me that stuff for my birthday. I already- I already have it. My birthday's coming up. February 31st. March 3rd. March 3rd. Switch day. Oh, hello, old man. Give me your, my light arrows, please. Yippee! Yahoo! Ooh, his own. <laughs> yes! And then what else did I do? Oh, my cupcakes are still just on the counter over there. I should probably put them away, huh? My icing is out, whoops. The icing that I bought a year ago <laughs> when it was on sale. It hasn't gone bad, the expiry date is uh, next month. Isn't that crazy? I had it in the fridge the whole time, so it should be fine. But if I do get poisoned and die, it was the cupcakes and the icing. And because I got hit in the face today. Well, I have to go all the way back here. Bummer. I thought I got them all. Oh, another one of those. Just so many options to get rupees. You don't have an excuse for being broke in Minish Cat, man. Woo! Kinstone! Woo! Kinstone! Woo! Kinstone! Hopefully I'll finish this game by this weekend, because next week... Uh... I will be busy. Tuesday... I will be busy. Wednesday, I will be up in the mountains doing mountain things? I'm not quite sure. I was supposed to get a ride, but nobody has contacted me yet. So hopefully I don't die trying to get up to the mountain. Woo! This is a work event too, going to the mountain and they're not even gonna buy me lunch. How rude. It's like they're gonna buy me dinner, but it's like a like a party style dinner where they're gonna order food and we're gonna eat it at a location. <laughs> Not in a restaurant, but I am very interested in seeing this location. Hey, let me in. Oh, I didn't talk to him, did I? <laughs> I've been wanting to go to this place for like a really long time. And this is the first year I've been invited. Like, I was supposedly invited last year to this place in the mountains, but uh, I don't think I got the invitation because I would have jumped on that opportunity right away. So I don't know why everyone's telling me that this is not my first time. Liars. Um, what did he say? I wasn't paying attention. <laughs> oh yeah. Let's go get that device. Not really a device. Rather, it's, a, it's an article of clothing, more like. Look at these birds. Do I have fairies? Yes, I'm full on fairies. Cool. And we finally made it to the dungeon. Maybe we should uh, cut it here and then the next episode will be short? I have to put away my cupcakes. They're gonna get cold. But I guess I'm putting them away and they'll get cold anyway. Well, anyway, that was my Friday. <laughs> I hope you guys had a good Friday. Um, Catch you tomorrow, maybe. Alright, see ya. Sorry, this is not the second last episode, but next one for sure. Maybe. Maybe. <laughs> Alright, goodbye.